Good morning everybody, it's Blair Tyler and right now I'm just going for a walk, enjoying my greens here and I'm waiting for my laundry which should be ready in about an hour. Yes, finally found some kombucha. Definitely going with the ginger. A huge staple to my Thai diet, green curry. And I love that they have some brown rice finally. It's so satisfying when they have lots of veggies in here. I was just walking around this really cool area checking out all the artwork and I met this really nice lady, Brenda. Hello! And she gave me a little bit of information about uh, what this used to be. Yeah, I just found out that this whole complex used to be a men and women's prison and I was told that they moved the men outside the city several years ago and then just a couple of years ago shut the whole thing down. So now it's this abandoned property with great graffiti everywhere. So nice meeting you, Brenda. Yeah, you too. Take care. Brenda was just letting me know that there's a market going on today, so I'm gonna head there and check it out. Here we are, Friday market, healthy foods and handicraft. Let's enjoy. This is so beautiful. The rose petals. Did not know those were edible. How cute do all these look? I'm so curious as to what they all taste like. I'm gonna start with what I think is gonna be my favorite. I'm not sure on the exact flavor, but it's covered in coconut, so. <laughs> wow, that is different. Hmm. Not really too sure on the flavor on that one. It tastes very earthy, very green. I'm just gonna think to myself that it's like a greens coconut ball. That's what it was. This one's not too bad. It's just like a little jelly candy. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to eat this whole thing or just scoop this out like this, but this one weirdly tastes exactly like carrot cake. This one is definitely the winner. Mm. It's weird because it tastes so similar to carrot cake, but it's such a different texture. It's very like gelatin-y, but tasty. I got so distracted with wandering around today that I forgot I was headed to a self-empowerment meetup today. I haven't really done something like this before, but I was just inspired to do it, so I thought, why not? Here we come, self-discovery. So I'm headed just down the street here, about a five minute walk to Sang D Gallery and Cafe. All right, Sang D. For some reason I want to say it like that. <laughs> Maybe because it's like Chuck D. Loving the art in this cafe. A little bit nervous, I don't really know what to expect. Um, never been to one of these types of events before. But I just met Hugh and he seems like a really great, positive guy. So I'm sure I'll take a lot out of this. So I just finished up at the workshop. I met a new friend. Her name is Nikki, and she is from San Francisco. We had a lot of great conversations and ended up connecting after, and she let me know about Chiang Mai's month of photography, which we're going to head to now. Obviously, I'm really excited about that. And uh, we're just heading to get some really great coffee out here at Ristretto. They say it like tastes that. different if you put it in porcelain versus glass. Oh, really? I can't tell the difference, but they claim it. And then uh, Nikki ordered this one right here, which is really good. And if you get this one, this has sort of a chocolatey, minty flavor to it. It's Ooh, very strong. A little yum. sugary. Yeah, I prefer not sweet, but yeah. um, chocolate and mint sounds good. I'm gonna go with the cigarette. Yeah, great call. By the way, this is David. Yes. He's Nikki's husband. We paired up for one of the exercises, and I was saying that he's working on working out more. Oh, okay. So kind of putting him in that there. Definitely hands down the best coffee I've had yet in Thailand. Ristrato Lab, check it out. This goes on maybe all the time. <laughs> Hey, listen, I say that we get some food. I agree. I'm that was absolutely one of my favorite. So here we are, the grand opening. really fascinating, not only all of these pictures, but the way they set up this gallery. This exhibit is underneath what looks like a house or something. And there's also another one just near the entrance, which is in a Muay Thai stage, and a bunch of different arrangements, which I think really adds to all of these powerful images. Ha ha ha. 
Yeah. Just like half press that. Oh no. That's over there. Wow. That's, that's oh, yeah. hilarious. Yeah. Just took part in this little photo booth project with the sky behind me watermarked with the Thai flag. Can I say something with you? Yeah, sure. Hi, thank you for my project. <laughs> this is See your you. project? Yeah. Yes, what are you going to do with that? I mean, I don't know where you're from. I'm from Canada. Canada, I go to Canada, okay? Awesome, uh, we'll yeah. be seeing you yeah. in Canada. Bye. See you soon. <laughs> <laughs> Just on my way home after the Chiang Mai month of photography exhibit and I honestly had such a great time. I'm so thankful that I met Nikki today at the self-discovery workshop. Bumped into a little street market here. Hear that music? Just exploring right now. <laughs> this is an orchid contest going on. Like, wow. Ooh. Ah, amazing. Number one, number one. Mm -hmm. So I'm about to hunt down some street food. Probably should go this way or down this alleyway. I'm just gonna go to the left. I'm just not really too sure, but yeah, guess we'll just see where we end up. <laughs> oh, I'm getting hungry and more lost. About to become hangry, but I'm by myself, so I can't hurt anybody. All right, I think I'm becoming more confident that this is not the way. I'm learning to never give up, even though you might have doubt. All right, I made it to a street. I'm gonna say to the right this time. All right, I'm confused, but this place looks busy, so I'm gonna check it out. It seems to be a local hot spot. I hope my food doesn't take long. I am so hungry, but I'm sure it's gonna be delicious. I ended up just going with the stir fried mixed vegetables with chicken and rice. Keep it simple. I feel like I'm gonna end up eating later. I don't know why. I just feel hungry. I'm at the point where I'm so hungry, I feel like I can eat so much, but I'll probably get my meal and be like three quarters done and already be full. Yeah! Oh my god, I just saw a rat and I could just hear them all running around. Ooh. Hey, no, no, no. 